Hi Water Science, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your weeklies for this coming week of January 21st until the 27th, 2024. That's a lot of twos. <laughs> Please keep in mind that this is a general reading so if you are interested in your own private reading, all that information as well as the Amazon link to my new book, Accepting the Gift, is down below in the description box below. So let's get started here. We're going to work on Scorpio first, my little Scorpios. We're going to do 30 seconds for you guys here. This is a 15 card spread. Be dealing with the Sagittarius here. <laughs> I've done the same thing. Uh, I literally hear, I'll give them one more chance. I'll give them one more day. I'll give them one more chance. <laughs> I keep hearing this, right? With the temperance here, I'll wait it out. It's been tough. Oh, I don't know what to do. But I'm hopeful that they'll come back kind of thing. You know, I got to calm my energy down. Man, do I miss them. I miss having some fun times with them here. I do miss them here. Uh, and there's a lot of stagnation. You get up in your head here, you know. Uh, but everything will balance out. Everything will be cleared up here, okay, with the justice and the moon. Somebody's coming back. Could be dealing with an Aries energy or just fire sign in general here. But uh, really, it's about somebody showing the effort to uh, work on things, to communicate, to speak the truth, to clear up the confusion of it all. Uh, but definitely, yeah, definitely with the moon and the star right above each other. And I feel this is going to happen at night. Both pictures are... Yes, I do follow pictures. <laughs> Cats out of the bag. No, but I always have. So it's not a secret there. But they're both like a really, really pretty blue. So I'm feeling that it's like a nighttime thing when they're going to be com communicating back to you here uh, and explaining things and kind of wondering whether or not uh, you will accept them back, okay, for this love. They are a little nervous, I will say that, but everything can work out. That might be your energy too. It's kind of like, hmm. You did this once to me, what, what's not stopping you from doing it again? Meaning the ghosting here, putting me through a lot, you know. You both miss each other, you know. Yeah, I know. I just literally heard, and I was somebody in particular, okay? And we're not pointing fingers here at all. But somebody is literally saying, well, you did this, you know. And here I am pointing fingers, right? But I feel like there's pointing fingers over a situation, kind of really calling them out, really chewing up you know, they're yin yang. <laughs> but I do feel that you both miss each other. You're both hurt, you know, you're hurt, you know, and you take that out on them and they know that, you know, but they're willing to move forward and, and explain things to you and speaking the truth here. So you do you, but maybe, maybe just turn it down a little <laughs> with the pointing finger kind of thing. Hey, look, I do the same thing, you know, uh, but yeah, definitely. So it's just because you were hurt by their actions that you miss them, you know, and you just kind of want to ah, at them a little bit, you know, and I totally get that. It's cool with me. Uh, but anyway, not that I'm here to judge by any means. Uh, let's go and do a, the above and below here, the temperance, the hangman and the page of swords. Well, that just basically tells me it's been a long journey and you've had a lot of patience before they have returned here. The Wheel of Fortune, the Devil, and the Two of Swords. So there's that confusion of, uh, you know, I'm going to give them one more chance. You're up in your head here. You're having that Two of Swords, which is up in your head, trying to make a decision. You know, uh, I'm going to give them one more chance. It's very confusing, but they are going to beat you to the punch, really. And they're going to communicate and offer that cup of love with the Seven of Cups, the Justice here, and the Ace of Cups energy. With the Star, the Moon, and the Eight of Swords, this is very uh, confusing up in the head to get this wish fulfillment because you had happiness. They remember the happy times, the good times as well, and they're going to come back and fix it is my favorite expression, okay? So the Three of Swords being in the outcome, the Five of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, and the Chariot. So it's kind of like, are you for real? Are you going to hurt me again kind of thing? So there's this fear based of whether or not, uh, you know, they're going to hurt you again. Because you both miss each other. You really miss them. You could say something like, you know, um, you know, kind of rip them a new one. And that's fine. That's fine. That's approved in Deb's eyes. Uh, but definitely, it's just going to take some time. So 
I I'm the worst. My dad always used to tell me, Scorpio, that um, you never think first before you speak. And that still lives to this day, you know. Uh, and I'm 55, like the speed limit. <laughs> like the speed limit. Anyway, moving on to cancer. Isn't that great? To have your age as the speed limit. <laughs> All right, moving on. Now, actually, I think it's 60. <laughs> How old am I? Anyway, moving on. Cancer. Oh, I see. So, Cancer, I feel that you've had enough. They make me zoom in on certain things, and there's the hand. It's like, even though I'm upside down, I'm still saying, say ya, you know, to what? To the confusion of it all, to the tough times here. And before that hangman is the star. So there's that healing energy, okay? You, you've waited long enough, okay? You're moving forward, I do feel that. Mm. There is some trust issues, I do feel that, but... Uh, regardless, the minute that you walk away, um, they're coming back. There's going to be this communication kicking on in, okay? And they're going to clear up the hot mess here, okay? And I really feel for one, uh, somebody's kind of getting too much in their head. It's okay. I'm an air sign. I believe in that. Uh, but definitely, you know, it's kind of like, it's just kind of like, you're not 100% sure what they've been doing in the past, you know, if they're seeing somebody new or what have you. And you're kind of like, well, you're seeing somebody or you did see somebody. And they're going to they're gonna explain that they're in the clear, you know, regardless of their past or whatever. They're in the clear. They're single. You know, they're ready to get back into this because they do miss you. They want this happiness. They have reviewed how they handled themselves in the past by walking away. And now they want that change to take that next step with you here, okay? So they're gonna have a lot of strength, okay? Because you feisty cancer, it's all right. Uh, but definitely you have to hear, well, I shouldn't say you have to, I can't say anything that have to, you know, if you would wish to hear them out here because they're gonna explain everything. They wanna put that bounce back in and they're hoping that you can chime back into it too, meaning not giving them the silent treatment. I do that. Uh, when I get mad at somebody or whatever, you know, whatever, uh, sometimes I just clam up and I just don't talk, you know, and I think that's the worst torment <laughs> for to do to somebody and I do it, you know, so just try to kind of correspond back is what this says. Try to have that inner strength to give back into this too. So, uh, but no, I get it. You may have a little bit of Libra in your chart. <laughs> so just saying, uh, but here we go above and below. You got the star. Uh, this page of swords here and the three of cups. So there's wish fulfillments coming in, happiness through communication after quite an ordeal of waiting. Um, you know, they're going to be coming back and communicating. You may need the time to think about things for sure. Uh, but I do, sorry, my card just went a little haywire. Sorry about that. Uh, but definitely, you know, it's been a very long, confusing situation, you know, uh, why they left. But uh, and it's it's been a tough cycle for you here with the Seven of Cups, the Moon, the Eight of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, the Justice, and the Death card. That tells me is that they are going to be correcting the situation for this change here. So the Temperance, the Devil, and the Four of Wands. So it's kind of like, I've waited so long. I could plan a whole script in my head of, of what they have done in the past. And I don't know if, if I believe them, but now they're coming back and you want to take the next step. Silent treatment. <laughs> do the deb. Don't do the deb. Uh, open. Open. You know, communicate to them for sure here. It's going to take a lot of strength to participate, I feel, for some out there because they hurt you, you know. And that's rightfully so. Believe me, I do the same thing. So don't even worry about it. But that is what I have for... Uh, the sign of cancer. All right. Interesting spread. I like when they're in detail. I like that. Pisces. Pisces is 926 here. All right. Let's find out what we need to know for this coming week of January 21st to the 27th, 2024 for the sign of Pisces. Up in your head, really worried about a new start in regards to love to take that next step. 
there's upcoming decisions that is going to bring happiness here. And it's kind of like, why are you back? You know, after they walked away, they want to come back. They want this change. Listen to them. A very similar energy to cancer here with listening to them. Okay. Believing them too, forgiving them for walking away from them, from you. Not really sure if you're speaking the truth here, but I'll listen to you. I'll hear you out because I was very confused as to why you left, okay? Seven of Cups, Page of Wands. So it's not going to be an easy fix here, Pisces, for you to believe them, for them to come back as well. But they know that they really mess things up, okay? And it's going to take a lot. It's not a one-night uh, fix here. It's going to be a lot of explaining as to where have you been, why would you put me through this? You know, uh, you know, a lot of questions, you know, up in the air. But I, yeah, see, you're going to have a lot of communication, okay? It's not just one time, all right? Definitely. Uh, until they solve the issue with explaining, with speaking their mind and explaining things to heal this situation. Right to the point. Okay. So let's do the above and below. So it's been a hot mess to take that next step because you just want what is fair. And what is fair is, um, you know, the truth, okay, as to what do you really want? You know, this is to your significant other here. What they want is, is okay, <laughs> they just got a little naughty there, uh, is to start anew here, to communicate here, to get a little naughty with you too, with that devil energy, uh, the Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. So they just don't want the naughtiness, but they, they want to participate. They want to communicate and they want to offer that love. Two of Swords, the Strength card and the Temperance, interesting energy, big time. So there's a decision that you really have to think about of whether or not you want to take them back here because it's been such a long time. But there is happiness if guilt, if granted, okay, if you do want this, there's a change to work out the kinks of this relationship here. But it's kind of hard to forgive. It's hard to move forward because in the back of your head you're still going to be a little confused as to are they going to walk away again with the hermit the eight of cups and the moon so with the outcome being the seven of cups saying i'm confused <coughs> excuse me talk to me again let me explain things to you again let me clear up this confusion then you hang up then a few hours later i'm still going to work on this i'm not going anywhere let's communicate again and finally it's healing energy and getting this wish fulfillment, meaning that you will believe them then the second time around. Could be the third time, you know, as well, however long it takes. And that is what I have for not just Pisces, but for all the air of uh, water signs. Hello. Uh, but that's what I have for all the water signs out there. Thank you all for watching. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.